hello youtube in this video tutorial i'm gonna show you how to play monopoly streets on pc using nintendo y emulator that is the dolphin emulator first you need monopoly streets i have mo downloaded monopoly streets but it's in wfps form let me show you where it is i recently downloaded it and it is in the form of wbfs as you can see now it will come here it is wbfs now its uh, um, size is around 700 mb but this cannot be played by the emulator directly you have to use y backup manager to convert this wbfs file to iso file then after converting to iso file just open the emulator and use uh, this to select the game you want to compress and just right click it and compress since i've already compressed it and it cannot be compressed further uh, i can only decompress it into iso but the iso size of each and every nintendo y game is around 4.4 mb which is quite uh, sorry 4.4 gb which is quite big so it's better to keep it in compressed form and here it is the compressed form is 782.9 mb monopoly streets and the first of all if you have already used the emulator you must have changed its graphic settings up according to you and since many good computers of today use directx 3d 11 so they might click on this and click uh, and select this uh, settings to play the game but this is quite a um, bad setting for this game because this game doesn't support direct 3d 11 directly so I'm just gonna play it and show you the problem see the game just hangs here in the back screen you can guess directly that this is due to the direct 3d 11 and um, there is a very simple way to get out of this problem just close it and then graphics and then select it either direct 3d 9 or OpenGL and then click close then again I'm gonna play it I'm not going full screen mode because in full screen mode the game freezes and crashes which makes a lot of problem so it's better not to play in full screen mode now if you are still having problem like this then just change the graphic setting to whatever possible drag to 9 now this should work for sure there it is DAC 9 this is the least setting you can do to play the emulator at full speed now the game's running at good speed and it will load up sometime since I'm using a recorder to record my desktop it has slowed down my PC but it will work fine now let's see I can even load a state that I have already used <laughs> there you can see the fps is running fine it's not hanging and there starts the game i can load it in full screen but sometimes the game crashes in full screen that's why i'm not doing so As you can see the game's working perfectly with this emulator only the thing is that you need to configure it properly if you have any doubt just post it in the comment section and i will try to help you out and please remember the most important is graphic setting 
do whatever tricks you can to make it as fast as you can and try not to play in full screen mode at the start after a little progress you can save space by pressing shift f1 and then start the game by directly that's from that state by just loading the game and pressing the f uh, function key then remember that make tricks here to make it compatible with your pc and run it smoothly and if still have problem just the most important part is use any one of it this will work fine and gr with great speed and now this should work fine and if any problem still persists please don't forget to ask in the command section and for the controller you have to do a lot of experiments for each game there should be a different control settings let me show you here it is the control setting for mm, the monopoly game load this is the same control setting for monopoly game and for inazuma 11 strikers load the same um, joystick but different settings because different games use different settings and you don't need unnecessary keys this makes the game slower and even makes sometimes useless just wasted of your available keys so use proper settings for proper keys if you want any instruction for a proper game just ask it and I will tell you now I'm gonna tell something more about the Inazuma 11 Strikers non-English versions see I have Inazuma 11 Strikers 2013 and 2012 sorry 2012 extreme and 2013 as you can see these games are in Japanese and I cannot uh, read them because I don't know Japanese or Chinese or whatever language it is so the best way to is um, just tweak with the games after loading the game I can just tell you the settings and what is they use for uh, let me tell you the settings of any one the one setting can be used for others too the f best way is to use Ninazuma Strikers strikers english version and use its settings for the J japanese versions too S this way you can play the japanese games but one more you must have observed in em dolphin emulators versions below 3 there is a problem of 5D's you 5D's master of cards that it crashes the best way to solve it is to update your emulator and download the latest version this will stop the crashing and you can play the game smoothly without any problem and if you want any torrents I can just post the download uh, links in the description if you want just ask in the comment section and within 2-3 days I will give the link to its torrent. Thanks for watching and don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe. If you really like this video please 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 click on the like and if you want any further tutorial on how to solve any crashes of games please ask me and don't hesitate. Thanks for watching again.